Hey everybody, welcome to our very first vacation travel vlog. But we had to take advantage of the weather today because we are actually in the middle of Texas and it is snowing. snowing. It's crazy. So we are using this as an opportunity to, to, to have this in our intro because we had to get it on video that it is snowing in the Texas Hill Country. Um, but recently for Steve's birthday, we decided to get out of Dodge without actually getting get out, out of, of Dodge. Dodge. And we went to one of our favorite places in Fredericksburg called Cabernet Grill and Cotton Gin Village. And it's this awesome little complex of cute little rustic cabins, although they're so nice on the inside. You want and to stay forever. You don't yeah, want to leave. yeah, they're so nice. And he just finished building like the whole new set of new ones. And to top it off, he has a fantastic restaurant right there on site. So you could literally just stay there and never leave the premises. Unfortunately, when we went, the restaurant was closed for a week or something. But so we kind of missed out on the restaurant, but it actually made it kind of quiet. Mm -hmm. it, was, mm -hmm. it was quiet. But anyway, so we just want to use this as an intro while we tell you about our fun little staycation in Fredericksburg. After 26 years of marriage and raising two boys. Yeah, well, we're still working on that part. We're grabbing our cameras to have some fun. Photography, travel, parenting, marriage, and life. Let's get real about all of it. Oh, and did we mention we're converting a school bus, too? I'm Trish. I'm Steve. And together, we're, we're Team Rawls. We arrived to find a chilled bottle of sparkling wine from the owner of Cotton Gin Village, Ross Burtwell. Steve and Trish, so glad you could escape the kiddos and the bus project for a night of celebration. Happy birthday, Steve. Enjoy your return to your 40th, Ross. I'm not sure if we got the royal treatment because we know the owner or if they do something special for all birthdays and anniversaries, but it was really a sweet surprise. We just have to say that Ross is one of the nicest people in Fredericksburg. Not only is he a killer chef and makes some of the most mouth-watering cuisine in the town, but he truly has a gift for hospitality and a vision for creating this little village getaway. We've actually known him for several years. Steve has taken photos of his property many times. In fact, I'll mix some of them into this video since this wasn't the most picturesque time of year to create a video. The cabins appear rustic yet have all the modern amenities you'd ever want and are clean and cozy. And each of the newer cottages have one amazing shower. While the restaurant that is right on the property was closed during our visit, we did see the dining pods I've been hearing so much about. They look really cool and we'll definitely be back to try one of those out. And this is one of the best parts of staying here. Early morning breakfast that are delivered right to your room. Few B&Bs in Fredericksburg are true B&Bs anymore since they don't serve breakfast, but this one definitely takes the cake. We hate to leave and make the grueling five mile drive back to our house, but it's been fun. We may have to come back during the spring and summer and do this again. It's nice to get away. We didn't do enough of this when our kids were growing up. So if there's one piece of advice here for those with young ones, be sure to focus on each other as much as you focus on kids and career. Take a night away, keep a date night. It's important to stay connected. There will always be more laundry. There will always be more lawn mowing there will always be more errands to run. But the time you don't make for each other, you'll never get back. Use it wisely. So 
we hope you enjoyed that. And yeah, Bob's not quite ready to hit the road yet, but maybe sometime in the next year. I hope so. Or two. I, so. <laughs> I don't know at the rate we're going. Um, but we will do another bus video soon. But if you're enjoying this, subscribe, like, um, yeah. And we'll see you next time. Bye.